hey guys welcome back to the channel thank you guys for coming back today's video is going to be a quick little project share um i created some flowers and i wanted to share them with you guys and also i came across a post yesterday from bambi's mail and i'm going to have her is it bambi's mail or bambi deer i think it's bambi's bambi deer on one of them regardless i'll have everything linked down below so you guys can definitely check her out she posts up the most cutest things and totally inspired me when she posted up these little books and she made them like little mini albums but i chose to make mine small tiny little embellishment books so first off let me show you guys the flowers i found this file in the silhouette store and it's these ruffled flowers and you just kind of like bend them yourself with your hands and they look super cute you guys i used a bunch of different halloween paper and i'm going to be packaging these up soon look how pretty i'm prepping a nice big old halloween box for alicia so these are some little flowers that she'll be getting in her box super cute so i'll have the link to the svg down below so you guys can definitely go check it out because they are super fun and easy to make so we have those the next thing i want to show you guys is the books and i'm going to have i don't know if she has a tutorial but she does have a blog post i'm going to link that down below so you guys can check it out that's where she kind of gives the measurements and shows you the books that she created but look you guys this is the one that i created i don't have anything in them as of yet what I did was kind of like an accordion fold in the inside and I'll be putting the little embellishments in there. When you open up the book, this is what it looks like. It's super tiny. It's, look at this, it's on my hand. It's two by four. I did these little straps right here. I used the Hay Pumpkin, super cute. This is what the side looks like. I did a little eyelet here with a little yellow tassel and this cute little button some stitching on the paper and that's what the oops whoa dropped it and that's what the first one looks like and you can either do it as in a mini album or as an embellishment book which is how i'll be doing it i'll just be putting like small little mini embellishments inside of it so that is the first one that i created and then the second one is this one and it's plain and simple it doesn't have the accordion inside so you guys can see you can do whatever you want in the middle to put your little goodies inside or pockets anything you want to do but it's super tiny and adorable you guys look at this so i did this cute little charm and this little tassel using the wicked paper from my mind's eye but yeah, you guys, definitely check it out because they're super fun and easy to make. And what I want to show you guys is I just used some chipboard to create the book that I get sent when I place orders on scrapbook.com. And then you cut them two by four. Your binding is one by four and then two by four. And then you wrap it like you would any mini album. So I just placed it like this so you guys can get the idea. And then you wrap it up and then your book starts to form. Let me just add some hot glue to this one. So you guys can see it all sealed up. And then you just mat it with any Halloween paper, whether it's Halloween or any paper you want to mat it with. But you guys, you can whip up so many of these little books in no time. And look, you guys, here's your book. And then if you want to put a ribbon, you would put it here first and then your matting paper up top. You would put right here your little eyelet hole. But is that not cute, you guys? Super tiny. You guys know I love me some tiny projects. But yeah, that's my video for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for the next one. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye.